Okay, so we're gonna talk about colorism and I'm gonna talk about Nicki Minaj. Okay, I've seen videos on YouTube from her when she was, before she became famous. She was not famous in 2006, 2007. She really did not become famous until 2008, 2009. And I'm gonna go with 2009 when she was in that video with Lil Wayne, Lil Wayne called Bit Rock. That's when her popularity, her, she really didn't become popular until 2009. And her popularity dropped uh, increasingly since 2014. Because I have, in the past seven years, I haven't really heard much of Nicki Minaj. She does music here and there. And then later on, in like 2016, 2017, we got, we had Cardi B. Um, but before we had Cardi B, before we had Doja Cat, those, they're, they're very eccentric girls, women. But I believe they were influenced by Nicki Minaj. If it had not been for Nicki Minaj, we would not have Doja Cat and Cardi B. And Cardi B is as popular as Nicki Minaj and um, Doja Cat. Now, Cardi B has this very outgoing personality, confident, outspoken, speaks her mind, and she's not even African American. Let me spare you. She's a Latino woman. She's just light skinned. She looks like a, like she's African American, but because her skin's darker, she has dark skin. But she's very, she is a, a Latino woman. We all know Latino women are very light and look white. She's a little, she's she looks like a she does. She, I, at first, I thought she was a light skinned woman, a mixed woman, but then I realized that she's just a, a, a light skinned Latina woman. She's darker skinned Latina. But anyway, it doesn't matter. But I would say Nicki Minaj was dark skinned. I didn't know she was dark skinned, Nicki Minaj. So she skin she was used. I, a lot of people speculate, especially black people, um, that she 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 when she got famous, she started she had surgery to make her skin lighter. Or she because when I looked at them videos before she was famous from 2006, 2007, before she became famous, she didn't really get famous until late 2008. You know, and I really didn't know who she was, but until 2009 when she did that uh, song Bed Rock, I can make you a Bed Rock girl. Um, I, you know, but I, it looks like she was very, she was like darker, very brown, dark skin. So the, to her, to, how did she go from dark skin to light skin? Because she's very light now, you know. And I always say, something doesn't seem right about her. She doesn't look mixed. Both her parents are black, you know, and, and she been has been rapping her whole life. Um, but I look at her now, I know that her father got, got killed a couple months ago, so I know she's going through a little bit mentally, but, um, a lot, is, um, did she bleach her skin? Yes, I, I believe so, because if, if you look at her videos from when, before she was famous, when she was rapping, she's very brown, dark skin. So how does she go from brown, dark skin to a, a, a light skin? But she, but her features kind of gives it away because she doesn't look like she's mixed. You know, it doesn't look natural. Her skin looks kind of... It's a like it's it's a different kind of look, like a glowing kind of. So she did bleach her skin, but you know she is a multimillionaire. So a lot of people do some weird stuff. Lil Kim did it, bleach her skin. Michael Jackson bleached his skin to make himself look. You know, he just had some surgeries done to his body. So a lot of these celebrity black celebrities do have a little bit of self self hate, and I hate to say that, but for I, I but I, I I always feel I I I I didn't know that. But you know, people think that she's mixed, and she's she's no no no, or she was just a light skinned black, but she wasn't always that way. If you look at her videos on YouTube, before she was famous, she was very almost like really dark skin. So how did she go from dark skin to looking really high yellow? You know, but hey, hey, you know what? That isn't my business. Mr. Jager, peace.